morning everyone and welcome to my life we're down in the breakfast hall right now and all of our people are just getting breakfast and um, Lily, do you want to tell us what you have for breakfast? I have a bagel with cream cheese and a blueberry muffin. Yes, that's so yummy. And then Kaylee, frosted oh. flakes. Mm -hmm. And then for me, I have eggs and sausage. And I'm gonna get some mm -hmm. apple juice and then we're just gonna eat and then we're gonna head out. The itinerary for today is we're gonna leave to go to the ferry and then we're going to go over to the Statue of Liberty and then afterwards we're going to the 9 11 memorial site, not site, the place, and then we're going to the One World Observatory. Observa well, what is it? Okay. Observatory. Observatory. Okay, perfect. You always forget. Okay, I, okay, guys, I know. And then we're going to Chinatown, and then we're going okay, to Little guys. Italy. And stop! Okay, guys. I actually didn't say okay, guys. I have a problem with starting every single video with okay, guys, but I didn't this time. So we're gonna eat, and then we're gonna go head out. We're heading down to the subway now to go to the ferry, wherever that is. We have this nice little um, special liberty shirt and we just walked through the subway entry and now we're going to be walking to get on the subway. It is. On the subway. Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, I whispered. hats on. I'm whispering because I don't know if I can talk that loud. But I'm pretty sure y'all probably can't even hear me. But okay, I'll update y'all after we get off the subway and we're like on a ferry. We have made it off the subway and now we are walking to the ferry to go see the Statue of Liberty. got off the ferry the wind started to pick up but there she is the statue of liberty while we were walking we looked out into the ocean and all we could think about is the wind blowing super hard it's a little chilly here on the island since there's literally no buildings blocking the wind and we basically made like a whole circle around the statue of liberty we're trying to find a cafe and get food for for lunch and okay i really can't feel my hands everything else is like i'm pretty warm with my legs and my top but it's really just my hands and my mouth area i think i need gloves if i had gloves i would be Hey, okay. We're in the gift shop right now, and um, I got myself some gloves because my hands are literally freezing. <laughs> like, they're not the cutest, but they'll keep me warm. What'd you get? I got a shirt and a cap. They're down there in the bottom. Oh, yeah. okay, wait, there's a sweater. It's like really so cute. Like, like it's literally so pretty and i was like okay like i really want it like i literally picked it up and then someone was like oh how much is that and they were like 60 dollars and i was like 60 dollars i'm not about to spend 60 dollars on that like okay but i'm gonna stay warm and we're gonna go get um food right now we're just waiting on the rest of our group Okay, there's Azaria. Oh, she was lost. a little lost. I've been lost. Okay, but Guys, now... I need to pay for this. Okay, okay, okay go pay for that. We're all talking about the sweatshirt right now. Both, all three of us want it, but also it's just really expensive. I got sweatshirt. You, you did? Yeah. The gray one? That's I got the, the green color. 
Uh-huh. Which one? No, not her. Wait, did you get one of these, Lauren? Did you get one of these? Wait, how much was it? Yeah, no. Yeah, 64. I don't think I have enough money for that also. No, I mean, I do. I just don't want to spend money on that. But black people should never laugh. But yeah, we're waiting for two of our teammates. You know, for lunch, I had to get a pop along with my fries and we sat on a bench for our lunch and the cool thing about this place is you go and order in one line and then you go to pay in another line but what i find odd is the tables some tables have chairs and some don't so i thought that was a little interesting after lunch we decided to stop by the museum and honestly, this was such a cool experience. It showed you how the Statue of Liberty was made and all the different details. And it also showed you bits and pieces of her. And here is the different stations of how she was built. And not to mention, it showed you her foot. And here is her torch. And also, we got a photo with her face. Going back on the ferry, I stole Fia's hot chocolate because it was so cold and I need something to warm me up. But now we're leaving. Bye bye, Statue of Liberty. We went back down to the ferry inside and the ferry stopped at Ellis Island right now. And the next stop is going to be back to New York, which is where we're headed. So we're just going to wait for that. While we were walking, I got a cup of mangoes because I love mangoes. Drop a mango emoji down below if you also love mangoes. But we stopped by this museum, which was honestly so beautiful. There are so many beautiful things in New York. And here is another cathedral, another beautiful site. We arrived at the 9-11 Memorial area where the two twin towers stood. And right here is, I believe, the last standing tree of the accident, which I thought was super cool. I'm pretty sure this is the North Tower, but I'm not sure, so don't quote me on it. But here is another view of the One World Observatory. And look at that, you can't even see the top of the building. This just absolutely broke my heart seeing the family names of those who passed away during the accident. And here we're entering the One World Observatory and before we headed up to the top, we stopped by out in this area which I thought these things looked so cool. The roofs were giving that really nice image. But here we are at the One World Observatory and we're about to check in through security and this welcome board is just so cool. While we were walking to go to the elevators, it really felt like you're walking in one of those waiting lines to go on a roller coaster, you know? But what I thought was super cool was the elevators. The little numbers look like those Mario little cubes, if you know what I'm talking about. But on the elevator, it showed you the quote-unquote outside of the building being built while you're moving up the elevator. And the cool thing is, the elevator only takes 46 seconds to get up there and my ears were popping. walk out of the elevator they show you this new york show of you know just new york and right after the show ended the screen actually lifted up to show you the outside which was a little anticlimactic since you know it's a little foggy and rainy outside so you really couldn't see much but it was still a cool experience seeing the one world observatory we walked out to the mall and like i said this roof 
honestly it looked so cool and the lighting was just really nice and while we were waiting i got ice cream it was honestly super good back down the subway um, i think afterwards if it starts pouring again we're gonna go home but right now i'm pretty sure we're heading to china we're heading down she said, she said we're heading to China and then said town. <laughs> so it sounded like we're heading to China. We're heading to Chinatown. And then if, but if it starts pouring, then I think we're heading back to the hotel. Yeah, what it says? Yeah. And then if not, then we're going to Little Italy. Little Italy? Yeah. Little Italy. I don't know where I was saying, but yeah. I'm excited for Chinatown, but I do want to go home if it starts pouring because it's cold. Yeah. Right, it's the only McDonald's down here. It's right down here on the right. We're meeting there at 4:35. 4:35. Yes. Got it? Yes, sir. Let me talk to Coach. Okay, so it's like it's raining still. It's raining still, but it's not raining as bad, and it's not as cold. So we're only we're only spending an hour here in Chinatown, and then afterwards we're gonna go to McDonald's and meet. And apparently it's good. It's the rain is like okay for now. Like honestly, it, yeah, it's okay. Um, but apparently in like two hours it's supposed to start pouring, so I'm pretty sure we're gonna head back to the hotel. We're also going to Little Italy, Italy, Little Italy. Why don't I keep on wanting to say Little Italia? But we're going to Little Italy in a little bit afterwards. So we just went to two gift shops. How are you? Um, tote bag. Caleb is trying to find a Yankees bag? hat that's like flat. Like one of those like, tote bags, because I want to see A it. New York Yankees hat that's like a flat cap, but like they don't have it. The other store was like $45, so like, that's like almost the same. I mean, that is like the same as the original one, so like. We were around shopping, and now we're back in McDonald's waiting for our meet time at 4 30. And then we're going over to Little Italy, Italy. I thought I was saying Italia. Little Italy. And we're gonna get dinner there, I guess. Um, yeah, we're sitting in McDonald's on the third floor. We literally have all our bags right here and everything. Wet umbrellas on the table. So we're just here and we're waiting. We arrived in Little Italy and it was time to search for food. Here's Ari. So we're currently in Little Italy and we're trying to find a place to eat right now. Abby's being my amazing umbrella holder so I can film. Yay to Abby. And we're at like a restaurant right now but I don't think it fits us. It definitely doesn't fit Abby. But we're gonna still walk around. It's a little cold. We have two hours here. We combined with Addy's group. So that's why there's a lot more of us. Ow, my head. And then, uh, I don't think it fits all of us, but let's, let's see. I think we're gonna keep walking. We finally found a place to eat, and for the beginning, they gave us bread. For my appetizer, this was honestly super good. The bread was super crunchy, and the tomatoes were so nice. And here is my entree. I love pasta. Comment down a pasta emoji if you also like pasta. Still got spaghetti and meatballs. The chicken was so nice to cut into. It was literally so good. First bite, it was literally so good. I was also just really hungry that everything tasted so good, but still, I absolutely love pasta. I rate it a an eight out of ten. It 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 met my expectations. It was it was good. It was it was delightful, but it was expensive for what it was. Oh yeah, we but, got like, like the, the special basic. deal, which was like eighteen dollars per plate, whatever. And we got seven We got like an appetizer. Yeah, a three dollar coke. We got an appetizer and then an entree, and it was like eighteen dollars. The salad actually was really good though. I like. I, I was about to say, I, I, mm. yeah, it was good. Oh, okay. Yeah, she she did. I it was my first vegetable of the two. <laughs> Can you tell me, what do you rate it? Uh, 1 out of 10. I rate it a 9. We're now walking back to the subway while it's raining. And although it was cold, 
the view is still beautiful. Um, apparently it's supposed to snow tomorrow and um, I'm not up for that but tomorrow we're supposed to go to like the Empire State Building and then we have the Elaine Stardust dinner thingy or whatever I'm pretty sure it's Ellen Ellen, yeah. <laughs> Ellen Stardust. Ellen Stardust, sorry. Like, Sky, <laughs> stop. <laughs> and then, oh, but we have class tomorrow morning. Nobody Today, knows. raining was like really hard on us. Um, we're all cold and tired. No, because look at my hair. <laughs> <laughs> I, <had that. laughs> I can, I can see you in the mirror. The but I'm a little scared for tomorrow, but. <laughs> We're gonna shower I and we're gonna so rest. Gonna snack. And um, <laughs> I think that's <laughs> gonna be all okay, for well, today. Really it's been a really it's long and tiring day. day. Wet, like, hey, so we um, we're gonna be ending the vlog here. Bye guys.